Page from Altitude Elementary, and I'm here with Chase Lynn from Hi. the retrieval team. So what, what was the retrieval process? Well, so after they launched it, the balloon didn't land until like an hour, two hours after. And so me and my mom, we um, drove like two hours out, almost in the next city was like almost Kansas. Hi, this is Chase Lynn Ponsford with Altitude Elementary on the balloon launch retrieval team. We are headed east on I-70 towards Lyman and Stratton, Colorado. More updates to come soon. And so we went into this field when we were tracking the balloon and the, the sites we used were Stratosar and one other, I forgot it. Um, it was something like Spotlight or something like that. And um, so after we tracked it, we um, like, we went to it, but then we lost like service. So then um, we figured out the coordinates and we put the coordinates into the Google Maps and then we walked out to it, but then we figured out that we were 100 yards away from it, down. So we walked back, got in the car, and then we um, drove back down and walked out about half a mile and then we found it. So yeah, do you have any more questions? What are some obstacles that got um, in the way of retrieving the balloon? Well, so there was a lot of like um, tumbleweed and the, well, there was like this four to three feet deep um, like place with like tumbleweed in it and me and my mom thought that it wasn't that deep so we stepped into it and we like fell and it was really funny and then we also drove down to like this ranch down and um down there was um a bunch of like there was like two dogs and one dog was like super close to our car and it was like it was about to attack our car <laughs> any other questions no, I think we're good. Moose out.